Hey guys, welcome back to Care and Review Stuff. And uh, this week, um, I've got a product that you all been waiting for for probably more than about a year now. So, uh, what is it, right? It's the Christmas lights. And of course, I want to do a comparison. But this time, because as you know, I everything that I have outside of my house and as far as lighting, garden lights, uh, the sconces on the garage, everything is solar powered, right? And it works great, right? So this year I said, the comparison video that I make has to be for solar powered laser lights, okay? So this is what this video is about, all right? So let's begin with, uh, I only have two this time. Last year I think I did three. There are not a lot of solar powered uh, products, but in order to do a comparison, I had to get two that were pretty close to um, battery size and and uh, the solar array. Well, let me just show you so you have an idea. This one, I know I haven't said the name yet, but this one is a five watt solar array, but it has a 4,000, but it has a 4,000 uh, milliamp battery in the back. This one is a two watt solar panel but it has a 2000 milliamp so as far as a comparison you might say this one's bigger right but it uses more juice right and so it, it, it will last a lot longer than the other one but as far as uh, you know it's a double it's a 5 watt with a 4000 compared to a uh, 2.5 watt to a 2000 so as far as storage is concerned and the, the amount of storage, they're pretty much the same. And what I want to compare is how cool it looks outside, right? I, I look at it as like fireworks. I don't care if you have a thousand firecrackers, you know, if you have uh, a cannon on the other side that gives a big bang, that's more impressive, right? So this is what we're going to look at, all right? So let's start off with the specs. Let's start off with the solar. Uh, laser light by Damon style and pretty much you open the box and you get this this the spike right for the ground and this right they're pretty simple to to add let me just tighten this if it stops moving but this one you push it all the way down and then you, you spin it till it pops in right there and then it, you tighten it right there another little half a turn tightens it and then you have the spike which goes down here in the little screw and you're done right so pretty cool you just press one button and this might be the flaw on this one right they both cost the same amount of money double the size on the solar panel right compared to this one double the size of the battery right but you only have one button like a little red button and that's it right no remote control no other power options but I like that it's very simple so I don't know we'll see we're gonna test it right maybe it passes maybe it's better than the big boy right maybe that's why they're adding all this fluff to this other one because you know because it sucks right but maybe this one will be the, the winner right so we'll see what other specs do I have on it? Uh, it automatically charges in the daytime, of course, right? With the solar power. And it automatically discharges at night. So it's got a three uh, green laser. And here's the thing that I found that was interesting. They announced it as IP65, which we all know is waterproof, right? But the battery is IP64, which is not waterproof. How will it work in the rain? Well, I live in Houston and we will find out, right? Because it's always raining here. So I like I want to see what happens to this thing. So that kind of sucks, right? I mean, why not build it IP65? Anyways. So uh the distance also is 15 to 20 meters, which really doesn't matter. I mean it's just gonna distort the, the laser lights, but if you have something showing up on your on your wall, I don't think people are going outside like looking at a photo and going, you know, I think those 
stars of green and red lights are a little distorting. Anyways, on this side, we have the Amsu Solar, right? So in this box, we get a lot of things, right? Starting off with this huge five watt solar panel, right? We get the laser light contraption, right? And it is plastic, right? Which you know I don't really like. I like to go for the metal ones. But in this case, they're both plastic. And I'm sure it's because you have batteries and solar power panels involved, right? So you have to give up a little bit. But this one has a 16 and a half foot cable, right? So you don't have to have the solar panel out in the yard along with this thing, right? It's pretty cool because you don't know who might come up and, and, and snatch these, right? Um, not that we have any problems over here, but we also get a power cable, right? So we get to charge. I already pre-charged, connected to the wall here, you know, using the power uh, adapter that they sent, the power supply adapter, and uh, you get the the stakes. Here's the legs for the for the solar panel, and then here's the one for the uh, laser light, and then. You also get a nice little remote that I mean just by looking right one versus the other I mean I'm pretty sure I know which one's gonna win but let's find out So there you have it looking at the videos I know the video is not that great um, I can't get it any better right or else I would but um, me personally um, the Damon style right well let me show you the actual product I don't know why I'm showing you the box but this one right here this is all you get in the box right this right here one button right there so 49 bucks I actually like that one right the uh, I like the show right that it gives right because it does a little dance and all the lights and all that you can't control any of that but the way the sequence is and everything the lighting it works great I like it right but I like this one better why because you get double the size, double the battery, you get two different inputs, right? How you can uh, charge up the, the, the battery on this. Comes with the, its own little adapter to charge it inside. And, you know, this is a little lamp that you get with it. And you get a remote, right? The other one, this one, there's no remote you can't do anything you just let it it runs it it goes until it, the battery runs out and then it recharges every morning right this one you're able to set it whether you want two four six eight the different modes I think it's got like 16 different modes now what I did find and this is the way I'm using it right now is I have both of them on 
together at the same time and it's a pretty nice display check out this video guys so five dollars more for the Amstel solar forty nine dollars plug and play that's I don't know how else to put it All right so hope you guys like this video uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you next Christmas with another laser light projector comparison peace